Hi, I'm James Gladstone. I'm Chief of Sports Medicine at Mount Sinai, and also one of the docs here at the U.S. Open. And welcome to another gorgeous day here at the U.S. Open. It's really amazing. A lot of exciting matches have been going on, and today we're in for a lot more. So today I wanted to talk to you about bursitis. It's sort of a catch-all phrase, and what it really represents is the bursa is a sac that lies between something soft and something hard. So for example, on your elbow, you see, every time you move your arm, the skin rubs over the point of bone, the olecranon. And if you don't have something smooth gliding there, it's gonna get irritated. Now that sac, that bursa, is filled with little nerve endings and blood vessels. So if it gets traumatized, and that can be either by falling on it and banging it, or it can be from repetitive micro trauma where you just keep rubbing, keep rubbing, keep rubbing, it gets inflamed and swollen, and then it becomes thick and painful. So anytime there's pressure on a thick inflamed bursa, it's painful. Now you can have bursas anywhere in your body. You have it on your knee, you have it in your shoulder. That's probably one of the most common ones that we deal with. When you hear someone has rotator cuff tendonitis or impingement syndrome, that's the same as saying bursitis of the rotator cuff. And when you lift your arm up, you squeeze that thickened bursa and it hurts. So how do you treat them? Different ways. One, the first would be from by relieving the pressure on it, right? So not doing the same motions that squeeze it every time. The next way is by taking some anti-inflammatories. You calm down that inflammation. A third way, if it's really painful or if it's been around for a while, can be with a cortisone injection. And those really work like a miracle. Within a couple of days, you often feel better. And then finally, if nothing works, you can have surgery to remove that bursa that takes away the, the inflammation, that scarred in tissue, and lets a new fresh bursa grow.